a lab by scientists. Now it's all evidence based and predominantly evidence based medicine is run by pharma industry. The future is going to be big data and the technology. So we know historically insulin was discovered 100 years ago and it was found in the lab, you know, by looking at the pancreas from a dog, then the beef insulin, pork insulin, animal insulin, then the human insulin. This was all science based, done by research and all that. Then we moved on to evidence based. Evidence based, for example, this is what the latest insulin, Rizodec, you know, uh, evidence based medicine started with the forest study, the Scandinavian statin study and thrombolytic therapy. All this is evidence where you know you have the two arms, look at uh, different section of population inclusion criteria, exclusion criteria, and look at improvement, what is impact in HbA1c, glucose, fasting, and all that. This is all evidence-based. And then risk of hypoglycemia. This, this is what is happening now. But evidence-based medicine is predominantly industry-driven. It's not so much because it's, it takes a lot of time, effort, investment, and all that cost. So smart study is something. Uh, which was looking at this Rhizodec molecule, which was found to be superior to all previously existing molecules in terms of, uh, and then after evidence-based, real-world study, as you can see here, Traceba is a real-world use of study, where you see once a drug is approved and licensed by FDA, this is how it works, and again, there are different study reasons. I think all this is changing now. I think future will be data-driven, artificial intelligence, machine learning, you know, when we use the right drug, right dose, what is impact and all that. This is what the future is going to be. Young generation will have to step into this, whether you like or not. It's all about the tech driven, enabled, whether dose titration, Dr. Kalyan was saying, new technologies are coming in, whether we can predict the insulin dose for individual patients, uh, it's not just based on sugar, there are so many elements into it. So all these things, intelligent pharmacy is something which we have to work together. So things are changing. I think uh, we'll stop for lunch and we are looking forward to the quiz, which I think uh, uh, you all will enjoy. Thank you.